<laughs> just learning the tragedy, don't that was it. it. What was it? Do it again. Just there. There. And then out, out. Out, in, out, in, out. in, out. That's it. Ahead of his return to the stage at the Edinburgh Festival next month, former step star Lee Latchford Evans joins me now. And it's no tragedy that you're here at all. Ah, hey. It's not for once. <laughs> uh, now, tell us what you're going to be doing at Edinburgh. Yeah, I'm in a brand new musical called um, Eurobeat Moldova. Ah, yes. because it was, it was around before. Was They've Eurobeat. done Eurobeat before, and apparently that was a huge success. So because of the success, Craig Christie, who's the writer and director, he's come in and gone, you know what, it was amazing, let's do another one. So they've set it in Moldova. And tell us a bit more about it, for people who didn't see it the first time around. Um, it's basically a comedy for the Eurovision. Mm. Um, yeah, there's, there's a lot of puns in there, there's a lot of jokes in there, there's a lot of in sort of things that I think you can come watch this show two or three times and go, oh, I didn't see that last time. There's a lot to watch. The songs are fantastic. It was the music that drew me into the whole production, to be really honest. They are songs that you could see in Eurovision today. The production is phenomenal. I play Nikolai Nikovsky, and I'm also in it with Rula Lenska, who plays um, Katya Kokov. So whenever he's doing a link, he's always trying to sing his song and get it out there, and Katya's always just shutting him down and get on with the show. That. Yeah, it's, it's very good. Now, people can actually vote when they go along, can't they? Yeah, that's what's new and, I think, unique about this, is the audience will come in and watch. And we do the whole Eurovision thing where we'll go to the screens and, you know, ask the countries what you think, give us your votes, please. But then the audience actually do a live vote as well. So and it could fun? be a different winner every night. So we've got to be on our toes. Now, let's talk steps. Go on, then. Yes, you know <laughs> we have to. OK, so it's 20 years next year Don't, since you formed. Makes me feel old. Oh, don't be silly. Look, grey bits coming. No, you haven't. Terrible. <laughs> uh, so, OK, are you going to get back together next year? Let's just go straight to it. Let's go straight in. to yeah. it, yeah. How no, on? there's a... Well, to be honest, we don't see each other a lot. Lisa lives in Dubai. If you don't know that, Lisa lives in Dubai. Um, Faye's up north, H is South Wales, and Claire's about an hour away from me. So it's basically emails and things like that. The girls have all got children. H has now got twins. Yeah, I know. So I've he's, you know, obviously very busy with that. And... I don't know. I would like it. Yeah, I think it'd be great if the fans want it, of course. Let's let's see if we can do it. But right now, I can't say there is because there isn't. Well, I think we should just speak to them. I think we should just yeah, just speak get to on them the and phone say, and we sort all it out. want a little bit of I did it wrong. <laughs> it's not that, you see. Well, you see, that's tragedy and this is lasting on my mind. Oh, was so I getting too get confused? Them, yeah, people get them confused. Silly me. Is it true though that came from a home alone? Yeah, um, our choreographer back in the day, he got that from the actual still of the Home Alone poster. So I think it's more like that, isn't it? Yeah, he's like oh, that. there we are. And then he sort of made it into more of a tragedy. Maybe post. some people might have thought when, yeah. when you were singing... Uh, Possibly, yeah, that's where it comes I didn't. Yeah. I loved it. I absolutely loved hey, it. Look, we were Marmite, weren't we? You either hated us or you loved us. Oh. It's just bringing that fun back, isn't it? I think Good. Well, I, I hope you do get back together. Uh, but you won't be doing much dancing, though, because I had no idea about this. You, you've had a back operation, a very oh, yeah. serious back operation. Yeah, I've, I've been out for over a year now. I had... Um, Long story short, I basically had a disc removed from my spine. So, yeah, it wasn't, what did you um, done? wasn't the best. <laughs> no, that's very serious. No, it, yeah, um, more serious than I thought it was going to be. Is I basically, uh, they were supposed to shave it down. My disc was pointing out like that, pushing into my nerves. Nerves affect your legs and everything. I couldn't walk, I couldn't drive. I can't even change position lying in bed. So there's a lot of things I oh, couldn't do. So I was like, ah, something's wrong here. I better get it sorted out. So I had a scan and they checked it over and, yeah, they had to go in and operate straight away. So unfortunately, I was in a back, break for, um, back brace for 10 weeks and it's been a year. And I'm, I'm now back in the gym. I'm now moving and working out and doing things to get the core back and shape it up. But, yeah, I think even if we got back together, it would be quite difficult for me. I'd have to just hone the dancing down a bit. Yeah, you'd have to just sit in a chair doing that. Yeah. And... Well, we always said it'd be Zimmer frames when we came back. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be far off it. On your 90th anniversary, yeah, exactly. that's what we can look forward to. Oh, it's Terrible. lovely. And listen, best of luck in Edinburgh. Yeah, it's going to be great. Have a time with the show. It's the third to the end of Edinburgh, so the third of August, right the way through to the end, all the way in Edinburgh. Well, It'll enjoy it. It's a magical place and a magical time. Thank you. Thank you very lovely much. Lovely to see you. If you'd like to see even more great guests, then click here. There are plenty more fantastic interviews to come, so make sure that you subscribe. Do you know what's incredible? The, the faces of the little fishies, because in Dory, I can see you. Mm -hmm. And I don't mean that you look like a fish, but I can Seems see... Seems like you said that to me. I'm just, sorry. It sounds like you said I look like a fish. 